Oh, now then, my friends, welcome to the last in my series of my Lake District episodes. And what better place to finish than right here in Bowness, everybody's favourite part of the Lake District. Every summertime, you get thousands of people here on the streets. It's unbelievably packed. It really is one of the most, if not the most, popular place in the Lake District. We're going to have a wander down to Bowness uh, town centre itself. We're going to go and see Lake Windermere. Beautiful, beautiful evening that it is. We're also going to get uh, some fish and chips down there at a place called Vinegar Jones. Now, Vinegar Jones, I've been to many, many a time uh, when I was a child. I grew up in the Lake District, as you probably know if you've watched my other episodes. We used to come here every weekend and that was the chip fish and chip shop of choice. And my mum and dad used to love fish and chips. Brings back a lot of memories. It's going to be a beautiful walk. We're going to walk from the top here at the top of Bowness here. Don't get confused, it's not Windermere. Windermere is actually the town that's further up. This is Bowness upon Windermere, and we're gonna take a wander down towards the lake itself. So, without further ado, my friends, let's go. Now there's lots and lots of different shops in the Lake District. This bargain booze here, I think this one, used to be a place called Open All Hours. And years ago, I've got some video footage somewhere of me outside this shop. I'll try and find it. Is it on? You go get me there. That's a bit. That's a bit. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, less said about that, the better. Onwards. Now I want to try and cross over because over here years ago it always confused me there was a little sign in the pavement itself i don't know whether they've moved it and it said this footpath is not dedicated to the public i don't know whether it's still there i'm gonna go and have a look if, without getting knocked over that is <laughs> there we go oh. Here it is, look. I'm not exactly sure what that means. Right, come on, onwards. Okay, I'm going to cross over again because right behind here, you've got a roundabout here, look. Let me just show you here. And right behind it, you've got some lovely little shops in this little alleyway, this little walkway through here. And also some beautiful restaurants. Just take a look.
Right, I'm going to walk around here, and this is where Vinegar Jones is. I'm going to nip in here if it's open. I'm really hoping it's open. It doesn't look like it's open. This could be bad. No, it's not open. Oh man, there is another chip shop. Oh no. Oh no. I'm going to have to find somewhere else to eat. Let's take a look at the menu anyway. Now there is a cost to coffee, however, I refuse, I completely point blank refuse to go into a Costa Coffee in a place like this because there really is lots of independent restaurants and cafes around that I think you should support. Now I think if I'm, if I'm wrong, if mine, if mine serves me correctly, there is another fish and chip shop down here and we're going to go and try and have a look, see whether that one's open. Without getting knocked over again, whoa! There literally is lots to do in Bowness. There's a Beatrix Potter Museum over there as well, which you can take the children to. That's fantastic. It's really, really good. I've been there before. Highly recommend it. Now, there was a chip shop around it, but it may have gone. Yes, it's open, so I want to get some fish and chips from here, take them down the lake. I've not been here since I was about seven year old, so can't really say whether they're good or bad. It was that long ago, it's probably changed hands. I'm going to order them now, see you in a minute. Okay, just waiting for them now. £7.40, fish, chips and mushy peas. Uh, five pence if you want a large fork. I don't know whether they've got any napkins though. I'm gonna have to ask that question. I am getting rather hungry, I've got to say. Okay, so I've got the fish, chips, mushy peas, got a fork in there as well, and I didn't have to ask, there's a napkin in there. Happy days, come on, onwards. Down to the lake, Lake Windermere. Let's go and have a look. Fish and chips by the lake. What more do you want? And a beautiful day. Right, I'm walking down to the lake. Now, as you walk down to the lake on the left-hand side here, there is an excellent place for ice cream, Windermere ice cream. It's literally famous. They've got up to 36 flavours. It's world-famous dairy Windermere ice cream. Ooh. You know what? I think that might just finish off the fish and chips. Oh, got a nice little bar here in the background as well. Look. Lakeview Garden Bar. Wow, it's absolutely packed. And look at that view. Okay, I'm going to do a naughty here, I'm not using the crossing. I'm going to sit right here and eat these fish and chips. Oh, just look at that view. I mean, come on. Right, let's take a look at what these look like. There we go, got my mushy peas separately so they don't make the uh, chips and the fish soggy. Got a napkin, bonus point for that one. Let's open these up. Oh, let's have a look. Pop that in there for the time being. Oh yeah, smells nice. Here we go, take a look. Right, 
try the peas as well. Wow, the, I've got to say the peas look a bit luminous. <laughs> look at them. See what they taste like. God, blimey, they glow in the dark. Pretty good though, gotta say. Right, let's have a look. Fish looks nice, nice and white, flaky. Mmm. Oh, hot. Try a chip. Right, you take a look at the view. I'm going to eat these, then I'll mark them out of 10. See you guys in a minute. Okay, well, they weren't too bad. There was a few crispy bits in the bottom, I have to say, like a few scraps, but some people like them. Um, for me, I'm gonna say they were, I'm gonna give them a 7.6. I think Vinegar Jones is better. Um, I had Vinegar Jones the other year, about a couple of years back with my mum, thoroughly enjoyed them. Uh, I came up in the car for the day, she dropped them all over my car, I got chips everywhere. In fact, whoever's got my uh, old car has probably got Vinegar Jones's chips underneath the seat somewhere. Anyway, what a beautiful, beautiful view. I mean, just look at this. While you're eating your chips, get your chips, go and sit on the front there. Just look at this. Absolutely stunning. Right, what I want to do is I'm going to take a walk around the corner here because if you've got children, there's a park over there. I brought um, H uh, and uh, J, uh, my, my children, last year, uh, just after the lockdown, the first lockdown when we got when we were allowed to be let out, and I brought them here. We stopped at the uh, Newby Bridge Hotel, which is just up the road and uh, they had a run around on the field. So I'm gonna show you that. It's also a good place to park as well because there's like a long road that goes round and parking is, is absolutely, it's, it's terrible. It's difficult, let's say that. It's difficult at the best of times to park here, but you can park on the road around here and it's a great place to park. So let's take a walk, come on, onwards. Absolutely gorgeous. Swans do make me a little bit nervous, I have to say. Got pecked by one when I was a kid and it does hurt. Over the road there, you've got the uh, the park, which is great for the kids. Look, just over there. And along that road there, you can park over there. This is just phenomenal. I mean, just look at this view. Look at this. You know what? I think I'm going to head off now. I'm going to have a beer. A well-deserved beer. Well, my friends, that wraps up the Lake District series. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you come and visit yourself because it really is worthwhile. It's a beautiful part of the world. It really is, and it's breathtaking. I've seen so many people in the comments of the first one that I put that they live like an hour or two hours from it and they've never been. Honestly, please support your local uh, economies, support your local towns, Support your own country until we can get overseas again, safely. This is amazing and it's a great part of the world. Absolutely amazing. I, d I need that beer, I need that beer. <laughs> My friends, stay safe, stay positive. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Mm. 
What? I had to have one, didn't I? See you later. Oh man, it's gorgeous. Oh yeah. Mmm. <laughs> We're in, uh, <laughs> I think it's, yeah, it's Bonass, yeah it is, yeah it's Bonass. Yeah, yeah that's Bonass. Yeah. 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 And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Don't keep moving the camera on. Sorry, it's loving. Eventually got it. <laughs> yes. Yeah? You ready? <laughs>